everybody! It's the official Harry Potter cow mount! <laughs> We're here today at the Harry Potter Hat. It's an unusual event. It's described as a combination of American football and netball, and it's played in 30 countries all over the world. It's called Ultimate Frisbee. So let's go and take a look. After Australia's great success this year at the World Championships, it was time for a more relaxed event, and the Harry Potter Hat Ultimate Frisbee competition was a great showcase for this unique sport. Max, you're the organiser today. How did you come up with the concept? Uh, it, I, I've got to say, it wasn't easy. We were looking for an idea for a fun tournament that could uh, that could be good, and Harry Potter was just released uh, the weekend before, so we thought, what a great opportunity to uh, to have something fun like this and just get everyone running around and uh, having a bit of fun. So this event's never been held before? No, this is the first time we've ever done a Harry Potter hat, and I'm a little bit nervous, to be honest, but hopefully <laughs> it goes all right. Well, it seems to be going well so far. <laughs> Each team is made up of seven players. During a game, the basic aim is for the team with the disc to pass it up the field to other team members until they get to the end of the field and score a point. At the same time, the defensive team is trying to intercept it or knock it down. Now, can you give me a quick lesson on how to throw a frisbee? <laughs> I can do my how best. How do you throw it so straight? Okay. I mean, the key thing behind it all, really, is about trying to get lots of wrist flicking on it. Unlike most sports where you're throwing with your hand, you really want to be flicking your wrist to get the rotation on the frisbee. Veteran! <laughs> and is it possible to, do, to use it like a boomerang? You can throw them high into the air and it'll catch the wind and come back down. So if you... Can you try that? Let's figure out which way the wind is going. If you launch it up high into the air, Now, Max, tell me about the spirit of the game. Sure. Uh, so, Ultimate's played with this concept called spirit of the game, as you said. Uh, so, the concept is basically that everyone plays and respects each other's rights on the field, they respect the rules, and they know the rules really well. So, when someone makes a foul, you can call the foul, and there's no uh, bad blood between you because you both know the rules. Yeah, thanks for a strong performance. Uh, Blue, let's have a three big cheers for Red. Happy! Happy! You've been watching the Harry Potter Hat Ultimate Frisbee competition and as you can see it's much harder than it looks.